So as part of our vitality, um, spring into vitality campaign that we are launching today, um, you may have seen the email this morning. If you haven't drop your email in the chat, we'd love to add you. Um, but recognizing that we are asking that people respond and reflect for what is it that, that is happening with and through Be Strong Families in your own life and the lives of others. Um, some of us work with families, some of us are a recipient family, right? So we, we, we have all, all people are present. And so we wanna know um, what, what, is, what is a positive difference that you have seen from Be Strong Families and or parent cafes, um, either that you host or attend make. And um, we'd love to capture these. We'd love to be able to just kind of share them out with the world and let people know um, what, is, what is happening in the world of people when we connect, when we spend time together, um, when we lean in in these, in these settings like cafes. So we're gonna give you a couple minutes um, if we wanna go ahead and drop those in the chat or like Andrew said, if you wanna raise your hand and um, we'd love to hear from you. I see a hand from Dana. Go ahead, Dana. So I, I'm a, uh, <clears throat> I'm a trained um, facilitator for Be Strong Families, and we're still trying to get our community to understand how wonderful this program is. And the reason why I know it's wonderful is because um, with the the small groups that we've had so far over the last, because we got trained in 2020. 2021, something like that. Um, <clears throat> we've been, I've seen um, in my family, I've been reminded through others' experiences at the cafes, how important communication and support systems and all the five factors really are in everyone's life. And um, I just wish I knew how to get these uh, parent cafes to be more attended across the country because I think it would help every child and every family and ev every team. I mean, it's, it's just a wonderful program. So um, thank you for having these because this helps me to get more ideas from across the country. Awesome. Thank you so much for sharing that. Um, Portia's got her hand up. Uh, in the, the, the survey question that we added to the link, mine was all about how the parent cafe, uh, the peer-to-peer -peer learning and sharing that happens to me is always uplifting. It's kind of like uh, centers me um, when I'm participating um, that allows me to know that I'm really on a good course. And it defines the fact that, I, you know, working with youth, uh, you know, this is a part of my living with purpose. And to hear and, and be able to share with other parents and caregivers is just phenomenal. But when I think about the, the, uh, the cafe resource and some of the toolkits that we have, I just don't use them necessarily for the kids I'm fostering and working with, but I utilize them uh, with some of the community uh, members of mine that are uh, doing positive programs with kids. And, and they are always amazed. Wow, where'd you get that? And I go, you gotta be a part of uh, this wonderful BSF, because if you just join a parent cafe, you will be amazed and go on to the resource and buy some of these kits based on what it is that you're dealing with. And just all that you all have provided as far as that, I'm sorry if I'm being long winded, uh, the social emotional learning uh, program pieces that you guys have presented in cafe. I am just like, yes, it's what we need and it's the understanding that we need to share because it's important about what's going on with these kids socially and for us to understand how that works, even when they're dealing with therapists and in, especially if they're in behavioral uh, schools where they're being you know, modified so that we can understand how to meet some of these traumas and situations that they're going through. So I'm just thumbs up, five stars to the Parent Cafe. Thank you, Portia. Thank you for sharing that so enthusiastically. I love it. Um, some of the other, the other words that have been brought to this space are bringing people together. 
Um, they help me to see the positive in myself and in others. BSF and parent cafes have made having difficult conversations okay, normalizing. Self-care, I always leave feeling uplifted. It brings a sense of belonging with the participant. Um, I've heard also it's a wonderful emotional outlet in a judgment-free zone. Great peer-to-peer -peer learning through the conversations and one-on-one -on -one activity. They are life transitioning in so many ways. Love it. I'm so grateful to hear this. I myself am um, a fan of Be Strong Families because the cafe was brought to my little town. <laughs> right. So we may not have all the big city resources, but cafes were there and it was a space for me to, to have a community with like-minded people who were going through and making the choices in life that I did and was making, um, that nobody else understood. <laughs> They're like, you're doing what, why, what, with who, huh? And these people are like, oh yeah, get ready for this is coming up. And I'm like, okay, you see me, you hear me, you feel me. Um, and then I know who to call, right? When, when, when those moments come up and those moments happen. And then I, I can feel just like I, I read a second ago, I can feel um, free to speak without being judged. Um, to say, this is something I struggle with. And rather than people saying, then quit. They can say, here's some tools, here's some resources, you know, here's some, here's, here's a, uh, here's a cup of coffee. Let's sit and, you know, I'll listen. So whatever it takes in that moment, in that season, um, to be able to, to find a space in a cafe for me has been powerful. Absolutely. Anybody else uh, want to speak something? Yeah. Um, just thinking about the positive difference that I've seen these strong families and parent cafes make. I, this is from a perspective of being tech support for some online uh, cafes uh, that we did. Uh, I was the tech support for one of our taste of cafes that happens every Friday. Uh, <laughs> just a little plug right there. Um, but I was the tech support and I was putting everybody into their rooms. Um, and once everybody's in their rooms, I'm just kind of sitting in the main hub, just kind of waiting for uh, people to come back after their sessions. And I can't think of anything more exciting to a Friday then sitting there and seeing like people start coming back and just see their eyes light up with just like the conversations that they had. And I don't know exactly what they talked about. And, you know, it, you know, it's just a small little gathering of, uh, of, um, people in that, in that room, but each and every time I see them come back and, um, I love seeing how excited they are about the conversations they had. I, um, and I love seeing, what they have to say about it, how it impacted them and their, their aha moment. So that's something from at least the tech side that I just really, really enjoy. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that. Thank you all for, for bringing yourself um, and your words and your wisdom, your experience into to that and sharing with us.